Yo, let's go to YouTube. It's your boy JTH. Welcome back to my channel. We're here with the one and only Raul Gooly. Um, Gooly. Yes, sir. <laughs> Him. We are uh, predicting, you know, NBA predictions for uh, this video. We got champions, MVP, Rookie of the Year, Deep Boy, Most Improved Player, Six Man, Coach of the Year, and we're gonna predict West Conference standings and East Conference standings. Snub, you want to make some bets? Listen to me. Listen to you. Listen to me. Go, yeah. go to Vegas. Book them in. Who, who's gonna win, man? Champions. Let's Chance. start it off. Yeah, you're up, man. So I think the Bucks, the Milwaukee Bucks, are gonna win. All right. Giannis How come you're not choosing these guys? Hungry. What's going on with this? You want them or what? I think we all. I think we all know. No, you gotta be honest, man. I know. Be... I actually think Giannis is gonna come back stronger than ever, healthier. He's got Drew Holiday. He's got. Uh, Chris Middleton, yeah. got shooters around them. But Chris Middleton is coming off that MCL or whatever, ACL yeah, so sprain is, or whatever. So is uh, Kawhi, he's coming off that injury. Yeah, but Kawhi's been playing and he's been looking good. Chris hasn't even played yet. I don't know, man. A... Hey, we don't know. Well, yeah. I I know. You're saying Bucks though, huh? I'm going Bucks. I'm All going right. Bucks winning. They're going to lose to the... They're going to lose? Gonna, they're they're going to win. They're going to win you going for the Bucks? against the, uh, Here. the Clippers. Yeah, that's right. Clippers, man. The Clippers. Nah, man, this is our year. For real, this is our year. I guarantee it, because, you know, we got depth. 1 through 15. Yeah, but you need chemistry, bro. We got chemistry. Have you been watching preseason? Guys love each other. They're sacrificing minutes, sacrificing shots for, like, our stars, man. I'm telling you, Clippers, man. Let me just put that in right there. I've never been more confident. I wasn't fucking confident as much as this year. 2020, I was confident, you guys. I was not confident when we fucking had fucking Doc Rivers on our team. Playing Montrez Harrell at the five against Jokic. <laughs> MVP. Right. MVP. MVP. Let's hear it. Nikola Jokic has he's a good repeating. chance. I think he's he's gonna make NBA history in three feet. Really? He's got Jamal Murray's coming back. Okay. Michael Porter Jr. is coming back. That team's gonna be nasty. It's gonna be scary. Honestly, they're a dark horse. That's less shots though for him. They're dark. Yeah, but he doesn't. He, I mean, he gets his, a, his he gets quality, he gets his assists. His best qualities assists. So okay. that's. I don't know. They're a dark horse. All right, all right. They they might win the chip. Oh man! But they MVP, win the chip. I'm, I'm gonna go with uh, Joel Embiid. Bro, what? Joel Embiid. Switched up so quick. No, just it, I'm going with Nikola Jokic as like my backup. Uh -huh. But I think Joel Embiid's gonna win it. All right, put Alex that in there, know. Joel. That's also mine. I'm picking Joel because I don't know James Harden. I feel like he's just gonna you know he took that pay cut. He's gonna be given more assists. He's gonna be more of a team player. I feel like he's worked on it himself in the off season, so I mean he's got I don't know, looked like he got stronger, lost a bit of weight. You say he lost hundred pounds. I don't believe that, but that, that's that, what that he has to say. <laughs> but um I don't know, I think him and Joel are just gonna bond and connect really well. Tyrus Max is gonna play well as well. But I think Joel could've won it last year. I think Joel could have won it last year and I think he's gonna try to prove everyone wrong this year and get it. Cause I don't think Jokic is gonna have the same year he did last year and I think Joel can definitely do that again so I think he's gonna be the MVP I, yeah same I think he's gonna that team that they build around him I think is gonna be really good yeah another dark horse for the East the East is looking really good this year yeah really man. good I mean both sides are looking pretty good both East yeah. and West in my opinion looks very like equal all right rookie of the year rookie man rookie of the year Max Christie huh really no. <laughs> Isn't that a Laker? <laughs> Come on, dog. Uh, the rookie oh, of the no. year, uh, I'm going to go with Paolo. Uh, to be honest, I don't know much about him. Uh huh. I know he was the number one overall pick, right? I reckon so. So, that's why I'm going with him. I, I, don't, I don't fucking know, know honestly. I don't, I don't watch college basketball, so I'm going to just go with him. He's been looking good in the preseason, if he's played. Do <laughs> You don't even know if he's been <laughs> looking good? Come on. <laughs> that, was my, that was my pick as well, but after watching the preseason, I switched up, man. Really? Give me Keegan Murray from the Sacramento Kings. Hey, he's, I got him in my fantasy team. I'm telling you, man. I was gonna go with. He's looking good. Really? He's low key looking good. I don't I, watch. I don't know. He's been shows. he's been hooping like, and I think the Sacramento Kings they might be in the play in this year or even playoffs. Watch, just watch. No, I, honestly though, man, you I should know, be man. you gotta watch out for that team. They're bro. smart. They should tank for victory. EPOI. Really? Eighty? Yes, sir. AD. He said he's gonna play 82 games my this season. My guy, he's gonna, he's gonna 82. He said, he said he wants to play 80. Oh, yeah, my guy. Is he AD, gonna play 80? He's can't gonna, even fucking I play don't, the preseason. Okay, wait a second. I think he's gonna do it. Okay. He's gonna do it. He's gonna, he's gonna man up, play, play the five. He's gonna get DPOI. I think he's gonna play 72 games. 72 games he's gonna play. Really? And he's gonna, you know, he's gonna show everybody why he's still a top five player in the world. 
I'm thinking low 60s for games played, in my opinion. That's just my opinion. Well, as long as he plays more than he did last year, I'm fine with that. Or the year before that. Alright, alright. So you yeah. don't think Rudy Gobert is going to do it again? No. No. Rudy's a bum. Really? Get that man out of here. Alright. AD? Hell no. Nah. taking it. I'm down. I think I'm going to go Rudy again. Gobert's going to go go with it again. It's either him or Giannis. It's one of them. Rudy? Yeah. He's durable, man. He plays a lot of games. I mean, I guess. And he I gets think, like two blocks a game, I think it was, or something? I think. Averages like 15 rebounds. Bro, that guy got ex He's been getting exposed every mm. every year in the playoffs. No, Donovan Mitchell has been exposing him, man. Right. Donovan, Mitchell, Donovan Mitchell gets beat, and then this man has to go out into the perimeter and help. And then he He's has to DPOI. run all the way. Still. If you're the DPOY, you can guard mm. any position, bro. Man, whatever. You said AD? All right. Give me Gobert again. Alright, most improved player. Most improved. I got one. I think Lamella Ball can get most improved. This man ain't even playing. He's gonna play. He's just, <laughs> nah, missing, they, they he's just missing two weeks. Nah, no, I'm kidding, they're not I'm kidding. Him. I'm kidding. Lamella Ball, he's gonna get most improved. I think he's gonna, no. he's gonna show off. No. Yes, bro. Lamella no. Ball. No. I got full confidence no. in him. Yes, Lamella Ball, most improved. Lock it in. Go to Vegas right now. Hell nah. Give me Jalen Green of the Rockets, man. Oh, brother, this guy stinks. <laughs> I like I like that uh, that one right there. I mean, it's gonna be tough though because they are gonna be tanking. So who knows That's if like the voters are gonna they're gonna take that into effect probably hard. But like I feel like he's gonna have a really good comeback year after what his rookie year last season. Yeah, I think he's about to about to do something nice, man. All right, six men. Six men of the year. Give me Lou Will, free agent. One for me and one for my home. <laughs> I'm just kidding. This guy. Damn shame. Uh, I think... Is Ben Simmons coming off the bench? No. Oh yeah, this might be bias. Oh great. Russell Westbrook. Oh brother, this guy stinks! Hey, hey funny guy! I got a joke for you! What smells rotten and puts people to sleep? Um, not just gas? No! You're... This man even ain't gonna be on the bench. He's coming off the bench. Dog, are you for real? I now? think you need look, to grow up. Look, be honest. Look, Who is the six man? It's not Russell if Westbrook. Russell Westbrook comes off the bench. We're maximizing him to the best of his ability. This is some I think he can get it. Look, it's gonna just trust me. Hell Russell nah. Westbrook can get six man of the year if he buys in. If he wants to win, six man of the year. If he doesn't, you know, he'll just be another bum. Yeah, I'm going with Russ, bro. What? I'm going with Russ. Dogs played one game off the bench Dude, this year, and I, he's not even going to be coming off the he bench. Told, he told Darvin Ham, I'll do whatever it takes to win. Yeah, he told him that, but he played one game off the bench since 2008, and you think this man's going to be on the bench every single game now. All right, man. All I know is... That is some blasphemy right look, there. Look, this one is it's kind of a reach. I understand this one. That's the biggest reach. reach I've ever heard it's in my a life. Reach, but I'm saying, if this guy buys in, he wants to win like he says he does. Man, I'll give you $50 if he's six man of the year. Right here. What are you giving me? Give me my love and admiration. Let's go. <laughs> okay. <laughs> give me Jordan Poole. I think he'll be six man of the year. The Warriors. Yeah. Yeah. It's a good one. That is a good one. It's way better than Russ, I'll tell you. All right, coach of the year. Coach of the year. Give me Ty Lue, baby. Give me Darvin Ham. Are you serious? No, yeah. I'm not serious. No, okay. no, no, wait. You're uh, actually give me Steve Kerr. Really? Yeah. I think the Warriors will be the one seed. Really? Yeah. All right, man. And I think Ty Lue. And that speaks for itself because Clippers have so much depth. Ty Lue's already a really good coach as it is. He made me, he brought the freaking Cavs back from 3 1. And you can't just say it's just LeBron. That's fucking Ty Lue. He's an actually good coach. And everyone who plays for that man says this man's a great coach. It, he's really good at making in game adjustments, something that Doc Rivers can't do, man. Man lets a 20 point lead go down to like five before he calls a timeout. Ty Lue? Nah. He does that timeout, maybe like 15 points if it's like a 20 point lead. Yeah, give me Ty Lue, baby. All right, here we go. NBA predictions. The West. West and East standings. Let me let me hear your first seed from the West. The West is the Warriors. I just said that. All right, you did say that. I was gonna see if you're gonna change up and say something else. All right, East. The East Sixers. All right. I think the Sixers can do it. This is a tough one. I'm thinking it's either the Suns or the Nuggets. No, Suns, no shot, bro. Really. No, dude, the team's falling apart. No one wants to play for them anymore. 
Nah, man, they're still a good team. Dude. They're a regular season team, in my opinion. I think they will try hard again for the first season. I don't even know if DeAndre Ayton is going to be there by the end of the year, bro. He is. He just signed a contract did extension you, with him. He, he had no communication with the coach. No so, but he's still going to be there. They gave up on him, bro. Basically. Hell nah. They gave him an extension. First seed. East. Hmm. Give me the Celtics. Great. What do you mean great? Celtics. This is an honest, honest review right here, man. You don't think Celtics are gonna go first seed? No. That's I think, crazy. I think they're gonna be one and done. Alright. Give me the nuggets. Alright. Yoke, like I said. It's also gonna be mine. The Bucks, obviously. Bucks are second seed? Alright. Yes. Be honest, you know. Do I think Bucks? Hmm. It's a tough one. Third seed? The Grizzlies. Alright. Why is that? You don't think Clippers? I'd be Wait, the Clippers I forgot about here. the Clippers. No, 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 no. Wait. Put the Clippers instead. You think they're gonna have better seed than Grizzlies? Yes, I think I think the Clippers are gonna be the third seed. All right. Better than That's the, what I'm too. The, the Grizzlies, just because they they got depth. And that's I don't think we're gonna be like tryharding the hell out of the regular season. My yeah, opinion. that's why. That's I why. think our main goal is to get there healthy. Yeah, Kawhi, low management, you know how it goes. No, he's gonna play, but he probably won't play back to backs because I mean he's coming off freaking torn ACL. ACL, man, like. Shit ain't no joke. Same's gonna happen with probably Jamal Murray, so he's probably not gonna be playing back to back. So I mean, yeah, but they still got the win to claim the MVP. All who right, man. Go, who might three beat? Honestly, it's uh, a real possibility. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. I don't think I. I don't think it's gonna happen though. I'm saying Bucks for mine. The Heat are looking good. All right, Heat. But I'm gonna go Celtics. All right, there you go. Can't be biased. Facts, man. Can't. They're proven. They made it to the finals. They'll they'll definitely be top three seed in my opinion. Yeah, they'll be top three, but I think that might even be one. But yeah, that's another that's story for another day. Since man don't like Celtics. All right. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Give me the West fourth seed. The West, the fourth seed. Grizzlies. Yeah. Right there. Grizzlies. Yeah, I think John Morant. He can do it. They got a uh, forward. Jared Jackson Jr. He's good. Desmond Bain. He's good. Mm -hmm. uh, Stephen Adams. A tank. He's beast. Uh, I think they didn't they just team. get someone? They got like Malik Beasley, I think. Who they get? I don't know. I think they got him. I'm not sure though. From the but freaking yeah. Timberwolves. They're they're looking good. Man, I'm forgetting about the Warriors. I gotta put them in there. I think. Give me the Warriors. Four seed. They just signed Andrew Wiggins and Jordan Poole contract session today. Yeah, Matter that of fact, means that green dude's out. You re you reckon? Dude, they, the season you think he's done? He's yeah, going to Lakers? I think he's going to the Lakers. Hey, yeah. uh, I wouldn't doubt it, honestly. Because he loves LeBron. Hey, yeah. yeah, for some reason. The East, I'm going to go with the Heat. Jimmy Butler, you know, Kyle Lowry, and that juicy thing he got there going. Yeah. Uh, Give me the Cavs. <laughs> yeah, I know you forgot about them, man. Give me the Cavs, baby. Uh, the fifth seed on the... On the West, you know, I'm gonna go with the Lakers. I'm gonna go with the Lakers. That that's like our limit. If we trade, if we trade Russ, then you'll be higher or what? We we could be higher, but as mm -hmm. of right now, we're tapped out of the fifth seed. Give me Grizzlies. I think you're forgetting about the Suns, man. I'm telling you, bro. You I'm reckon not they're not gonna be a top five seed? No, not top five. Wow. Devin Booker overrated. Chris Paul is getting old. I don't even put Mavs over the Lakers, man. I'm even putting the Wolves over the Lakers, man. I think Lakers are a 7th or 8th seed, in my opinion. Wait a second, I forgot about the Wolves. <laughs> They're 5th seed? Wolves? <laughs> yeah, the Wolves. I think I think the Wolves will get the You're giving seed. Wolves over the Suns. Bro, the Suns, I'm telling you, bro, nobody... They got right. chemistry issues, and you learn in 2020 that matters. Chemistry yeah, yeah. matters. East, even the Cavs. Alright, Cavs. And why is that? Donovan, Donovan Mitchell. Mitchell. Jared Adding Allen, Donovan Mitchell, Evan top, Mobley, with all those All Stars, they're gonna be dangerous. Ricky Rubio's they're coming be a back. Fun team to watch. Ricky Rubio's coming back. Ricky man. Rubio is coming back. They got Garland. There is Garland. Yes, sir. They might even be a top three team. Evan man. Mobley. Might even be a top three team. Might be. They they're gonna be nice to watch. Yeah. Definitely prime time. All right, who am I missing here? Let me think. What are the Eastern Conference? I'm thinking Nets. I have them over the Heat. They will definitely be over the Heat, in my opinion. I don't really? Know. Yes. Again, chemistry, bro. Yeah, they can now form that chemistry because that chemistry is going to actually be on the floor, not sitting in street clothes on the sideline with back issues.
<laughs> Man, I'm dead. Succeed, West. My lake show. Like lake that. show. Yes, sir. Like I said earlier. Forgot about this team, man. Everybody buys in. You about to be surprised at this one? No, I already know you're going to put Pelicans. Yeah, I already know. I think they're better than the Wolves. A well-round team, might. The opinion. thing about the Wolves is that they got two really good centers. The issue Pelicans. with the Pelicans is Zion, bro. You think he's not going to be all on the floor? Greg Oden. That's what he would No, no. No. Zion will be on the floor this season. This will be his comeback season. Watch out for him. Most improved player. Watch, maybe. You never know. You never know, man. But, Most nah, I got Jalen. You gotta put the Nets up there, even though with all the chemistry issues. All right. You didn't even want the coach, man. Should I disrespect the Heat even more and put them lower? You can't, bro. They've been to the... They've been to, they've I don't been know if to, I trust the Heat like that, though, man. they finals before, though. Ugh. You got them. Give me the Raptors, man. Six seed Raptors. Give me the Pals. All right. I think they can make it. Brandon Ingram, B.I. Still don't got Warriors anywhere in there, right? Warriors, Warriors are number I one. I mean Suns, man. I'm down, bro. That's wild. I have no trust in the Suns. You don't have to have trust of them in the playoffs, but in the regular season, you don't think they'll be top seven. I don't... How old is Chris Ball? How old Emmanuel is LeBron? Ball? And look at them both. They're both aging like fine wine. I don't know, bro. Devin Booker, he's not as good as everyone thinks he is, and I, I will stand by that. Before Chris Ball got there, there was a 17, 17 game season winner, bro. Oh, like, I don't know, man. Yeah, but they got Chris Ball still, so I see them being top seven. I don't know. Let me get the Wolves in there. Let me get the Wolves okay. some love. Raptors. Alrighty. Scotty Barnes. Here's where I'll put the Heat in. Seventh hey. seed. The eighth seed. The Suns. It's a tough scene. I'll put Lakers there. Alright. Uh, give me the Hornets. Oh shit, man. I know what I'm forgetting. That's crazy. They'll definitely be better than the Heat. Taking out them. Hawks. Okay, wait. I forgot about the Hawks. I completely crossed my mind. Like, I forgot about DeJounte Murray. Okay, like okay. that addition. So, take off the Raptors and put the Hawks. And then the Raptors will be the Raptors will be eight, and then the Hornets will be nine. Alright, bet. And I'll put Yeah, I'll put the Bulls there. They're ninth seed. They'll, they'll be a playing team for show. What's your ninth seed for West? Uh, the Trailblazers. That's Extremely what I was thinking. Underrated now. I think they're the ninth seed. Honestly, the Suns should be tenth. Damn. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. The Kings. Put the Kings in there. Atta boy. The month is a bonus. That's what I'm thinking. They'll definitely be in the playing. Definitely. They won't make the playoff, but they'll be in the playing. You don't think they can take the eighth seed? No. All right, they might, man. They are gonna surprise people. They, I really they, feel like they're gonna surprise people this year. They are a clown franchise. Let, let me. They let are. Me tell you that right they are now. a clown franchise. Tyrese Halliburton traded. <laughs> How stupid, bro! If you're a Kings fan, just leave. Be a Clippers fan. I tell you that. All right, man. All right. All right. My stupid yeah, the Bulls. Go. The Bulls. Yeah. Mine. My final spot goes out to the Pacers. They'll, no. be, they'll be a playing team. Pretty solid. Let, let, let me make sure. Predictions. Let me make sure before we lock it in. That's fine. Warriors one, Nuggets two, Clippers three. Okay, maybe the Suns. Yeah. Should eight be seed. Seven. That's crazy. Maybe the Suns should be seven. This is like a solid. Wait, opinion. wait. Put the Cavs over the Heat. All right. So, you got the Suns playing against the Lakers. Who do you got winning that one? <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Suns, man, come on. This be guy. Real. Let's be this real. This guy. <laughs> All right, but Clips, the Clips getting their first chip this year, boys. You it's heard it first. Year. You heard it first. Yeah, but Paul George had COVID. Couldn't even get to the playoffs. So, uh, yeah, this has been our tier list. Yes, sir. How, how do you feel about mine? Does it look respectable? It looks respectable. I don't know. The Suns are just a little bit too high in That's my, crazy, in my book. Uh, you'll see it in the end of the year. Come, come back, back to this. Review this. Review it. And I'm we'll you also guys, have a playoff prediction. Go lock my name, go to Vegas right now, lock it in. Nah. You'll make bank. Hell no! Don't listen to anything about this man, what he said. He, this man has Russ Westbrook being a six man of the year. Six man of the year, I'm telling you. This man's played it, once it's on the bench. It's a sleeper pick, but if he buys in, sleeper. it's the only way we win. Only way we, we, we get higher. Baloney. Alright, well, I've been JTH. 
This has been Rao. Ooey gooey. Ooey gooey. Yes, sir. And hope you guys enjoyed this video. Leave a like, rate, comment, subscribe. I've been JTH. I'll catch y'all around. Peace.